This is Tequiero Organic Field Blend from La Mancha in Spain. Yes, no grape variety to speak of here as we are drinking a field blend, meaning a variety of grapes are planted in the field, usually in no order with not much record, harvested all together and made into one wine. Now that's not what we're used to when we're looking at wines. You know, is this something new? No, quite the opposite actually. Field blends are a more traditional way of growing and making wine. The idea being that as different grapes do better in different weather conditions, you hedge your bets by having a decent variety growing across the field. That way, whether it's a particularly hot year or a particularly cold year, you'll always get a consistent crop. Okay, so vineyards or winemakers that specialise in just one or two grapes, that's actually something new. Yes, that's right. Having what we call a single varietal wine is actually fairly modern, something that came in with the rise of the New World wine regions. However, it leaves them open to risk. If you have, say, the perfect temperate climate to grow Sauvignon Blanc, and then one year it's freakishly hot, the Sauvignon will suffer. You'll either get less wine or it will taste different, which usually leads to a price change. With field blends, having different players that do well in different conditions, you're increasing your chances of a win. Okay, okay, that's all well and good, but how will I know if I like a field blend if I don't know what's in it? Like with any wine, to guess the flavours, you really need to look at the weather. This is La Mancha, a central part of Spain, well inland, very hot and very dry. Right, white grapes here will need to be hardy and will need to be able to put up with the ripening sun. This will make them fuller, uh, usually with tropical fruit flavours. I mean, yeah, it's still really crisp and refreshing though, you know, that usually comes from cooler climates though, right? True, but really great experienced winemaking will mean that grapes can still retain some natural acidity, even when super ripe. And it's that acidity that keeps it crisp and refreshing. I mean, another great all-rounder, I think. For sure, this will really go with most things. Fish, seafood, even the richer, spicier sauce. Oof, delightful. Cheers. Cheers.